Hi! I'm super excited! I can't wait. Besides it being December the 1st and I can now get into my wine advent calendar and my NYX beauty countdown calendar, I've actually had my first Christmas box of the season, <laughs> well not the season, of the month I should say, of the Christmas month, and it's Pink Parcel. It's not the Pink Parcel, the subscription box. Oh no! This is a Pink Parcel a special edition Christmas clutch. <laughs> Every time I say that word to myself, clutch, I just imagine the car, you know, a clutch on the car, and I just have to question myself, is it really, is a bag really called a clutch? Don't ask, stupid, I know, I know, but I just thought I'd like to share that with you. <laughs> so this video is about me unboxing the clutch from Pink Parcel. So this is how it comes. I didn't know what it was actually when I first had it. Right, you can see the clutch sticking out of it. See clutch, it doesn't sound right. No mind. So this is how it comes, just in a box and loose items like that. And then the box and then the clutch here. So basically, if you don't know anything about Pink Parcel, I won't go into too much detail, but I'll give you a bit of a lowdown. Pink Parcel is a monthly beauty subscription box for ladies, as it's also a monthly period box. So inside you get a mix of beauty treats and also your tampons or your pads, etc. So I will link the website down below, so if you're interested in taking a look, you can have a look afterwards. But yeah, I think the box is £12.99 a month and you can cancel any time. So now and again, they do special edition boxes, one-off boxes, and they bought one out this Christmas. And I was on an iron whether to get it or not. So I did, I went for it. I thought party season coming up, not that I go to many parties unfortunately anymore, but I am going to one. <laughs> Or two. So I just thought I'll get it, I'll get it. The cost of the box is £29.99. So a bit, did I say a box again? I did deny. The cost of the Christmas clutch is £29.99 and in it you have a mixture of beauty and lifestyle items that comes to over £100. So yeah, that's good, including the reversible clutch apparently. So inside the first thing I've got so far is a little leaflet. Now you get one of these little leaflets in the subscription boxes and inside here is all the information. It's got all the items and the costs and everything like that. So I'm going to treat this as a subscription box. So I'm going to grab an item, pick it up, have a look, show you and see what it says about it in here. Oh also what do you think of my new background? <laughs> it's quite dark. I could just see a white face in the viewfinder there. I'm sat on a box because I want to get higher because there's nice little Christmas tree like sprigs. I'm not sure if you can see them. They're up above me but you can't see them in the video so I thought if I go on a box to get a bit higher but then I realised my tripod doesn't go any higher so this is the position I'm stuck at. Never mind. Right, sorry, you can tell I'm a little bit excited. I go off on tangents. Right, um, <laughs> this is the clutch. Let's open it. It is massive. What a weird bag. All right, okay. That is a bit weird. Right, so that's what it looks like. Like this. It looks like a miniature pillowcase. A snazzy miniature pillowcase. Inside, you've just got one long bag that's down here and you've got a little pocket in there as well I'm not sure if you can see you've got a little pocket but um yeah do you know what I mean when I and I get this silica gel but it's like a little snuzzy pillowcase <laughs> so for it to be a clutch oh it gets a lot of air in it as well on on flatten it out for a clutch you'd hold it like this wouldn't you but then that would mean you can only put so much in there Okay, I am a little bit confused because you're folding it. If you put too much in your bag, you won't be able to fold it and hold it. But never mind. Okay, actually the more I think about it, the more I'm thinking about fitting a little pillow in there. <laughs> Just, yeah, I don't think I'd go out and use this as an actual clutch. But um, it's really nice, it is really nice, but I'm not a clutch type person <laughs> anyway. I am more of a handbaggy lady. So the first item is a facial mask, and this is a pomegranate moisturising and firming and lifting. And this is a sheet mask by Vitamaskers. Vitamaskers, it's Korean technology. 
I can't pronounce the actual name, but that's the one. I have seen this before. Whether I've had it in another beauty box, I'm not sure, but I have seen it. I have seen it, but um, always love a face mask. Always love a face mask, so happy with that. Let's find the information. So because there's quite a few items in here, I'll just tell you the price and if there's any other codes or anything like that that Pink Parcel puts in for discount codes or whatever, I'll mention those those as well. So these, this is a Vitamask Pomegranate Firming Lifting Mask and the price is £12.99 for four packs, so it's a pack of four. So that's the first item. Magnetone London Wipeout, an amazing microfiber cloth, removes makeup with just water. Now I've seen a few of these, mainly um, from Primark, people have bought them from Primark and it's just made me think, what the heck? But um, yeah, I don't understand it, but that's what it looks like, that's what the packaging looks like and I've had this, or I've got it come in, I should say, but um, it is gorgeous, it's like a little baby blanket, <laughs> like a little teeny weeny baby blanket, it is nice, it is nice and soft. I will give it a go and I'll see what it's like. So what's it saying here? So yeah, so the price for two full-size cloths, it doesn't say whether these are samples or not, I'm just possibly thinking they are. So for a price for two full-size is £15. Third item is a is a new kit um, or new CID cosmetics and it's an eye smolder, smoky eye pencil and shadow. Ooh, that's the outer packaging. Ooh, right, okay. What well, it says here, smolder silver. Nice, nice, nice. Packaging is gorgeous. Oh, that is really nice. I really like that. Can you see? Hold on. If I twirl it around there, you can sort of see the colour there as well. Oh! There's no shimmer or such or metallic or nothing. That's quite a matte colour. It looks, but it's a nice... It, it, it's a grey, it's a grey, it's a grey, it is a little bit metallic-y I suppose. So that's the pencil, I quite like that. This is what excites me the most. Oh, it's one of these with the sponge applicators and the product is in the Lidler. Oh, I like that, I love grey. Oh, I love, love, love grey eyeshadow. Oh, I love that. Can you see? That is really nice. Oh wow. <gasps> I like that a lot. So the information in the booklet says that this is a full size item and it costs £19.50. Whoa. <laughs> okay, so my next item. Oh, what's this? It's a little bag. It's a little tiny little bag, look. And it's got bandies. Bandies, bandies, bandies. Oh, I know. Well, oh, one of these, one of these, hair ties, all wrist ties, aren't they? All they're quite nice. I don't use them myself, but this will be a nice stocking filler for my daughter, I think. Such a nice little bag, such a nice little bag. I think she'll find that quite nice. But, um, right, what do they say? It's... The price is £5.95 or £4.95 with a Bandy subscription. Ooh, so you can have this subscription for Bandies. I've never heard of that. So, um, so yeah, so it's £5.95 for these. So no, that's one for my daughter. <laughs> Hikari eyeshadow quad in amber. <gasps> I think I've seen this in someone's Look Fantastic box. I'm sure it's a Look Fantastic. Wow, 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 look at that. Just me, just, do you know what? That is so lovely, that is so, so lovely. Look at those colours. <gasps> this colour looks identical to the Tease Cosmetics, um, I think it's called Indigo Something, that I had in last month's Look Fantastic. Maybe not as, yeah, no, it's identical. Absolutely identical. <gasps> nice, 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 I love these. Whoa, look at that one. Let me just try one. Yeah, look at that gold. Nice. And this orange, let's try that as well. Oh, not so much. That's quite faint. I'm not sure if you could pick up on the camera. <gasps> no, I like that. I like the packaging as well. It's really nice. 
So this is a full size and it costs £12, so £12. <gasps> so <laughs> next item is a nail polish and it feels nice and cold. It's a nails ink and it's the new white. Oh, this looks nice. It's a like an off-white pink colour. Oh, yeah. Can you see that? So yeah, I've just taken off some red um, nail varnish on my nails and oh, they're always a mess after I've had dark nail varnish on. It's mainly because it's left a bit of a stain, so I'm gonna have to really soak them afterwards and try and see what I can do. But no, I do love nails ink. I love, I do love them. I have a few, I've had a few from subscription boxes, which is always good. So is this 14 mil? Yeah, this is 14 mil full size and this costs 14 pound. <laughs> next item oh it's jewelry oh my gosh oh my gosh that is so pretty designed and made by pom exclusively exclusively for pink parcel oh that is so pretty let me open it <laughs> oh i do i really really like that can you see excuse my nails oh that is lovely really pretty what does it say if you were to buy this, this would cost you £12.99. Oh, that's gorgeous. Really lovely. Oh, there's more. I'm just dipping my hand in. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. It's another nail polish and this is a nails ink and it's Caffeine Hit. It's called Rise and Grind. Oh my word, that is gorgeous. <laughs> Can you see? It's all glittery really gorgeous colour. It's got silver, it's got like amber, gold, rose gold. It's got a little bit of a mix, grey. Oh, that's gorgeous. No, this is £11, so this is a little bit cheaper, but there's nail zinc, um, caffeine hit, rise and grind nail polish. Ooh, set and reflect finishing kit, MUA Luxe. And it's a, it's a white gold, so that's what the outer packaging looks like. And I'll just take off the cellophane. <laughs> Ooh, I wasn't expecting that to be honest I didn't know what well it's a finishing product so I was thinking maybe a powder or something but look at that look at that isn't that strange and it's got a little mirror there oh my gosh oh my gosh it looks like carpet <laughs> wow look at my finger wowie try it in there yeah, very iridescent, very shimmering, very gold, white gold. It's a duo compact containing a lightweight invisible cover finishing powder and a white gold highlighting powder. Ideal for setting makeup and adding a soft luminescent glow for a delicate and luxurious, luxurious finish. I am curious to try that, definitely excited to try that. That seems really, really cool. So this is obviously a full size product and this would cost you five pound. Ooh, nice, nice. The Patisserie de Bain, and this is sweet as cherry pie, hand and body lotion. This is a 200 ml. This brand is lovely and it's often in, um, their products are often in beauty subscription boxes, but let's have a try on my arm there. So this is a cherry pie. Oh, whoa, that cherry really, whoo, really, really strong. Oh, it feels so nice. It feels so nice on my skin. Oh, yeah, really, really nice. It's a, in all honesty, it's a bit too sweet for me. It is a nice smell. It is lovely, but a bit too sweet. But, um, no, I think my daughter would love it. So, yeah, and this would cost you £4.99. So no, one for my daughter. Right, we've got more. There's lots of worms. Right, I've got something big. Is it a can of something? Oh, it's Batiste. And this is a dry shampoo and it's the original. It's the one we've all seen in shops and probably have used at some point in our lives. So yeah, really, really good. This is obviously a dry shampoo, full size, and this will cost you £2.99. I think we're coming to the end. So that's... Whee! Oh, no, no. There was one thing. Oh, it's a lipstick, I think. Oh yeah, 
Oh, we had one of these in the pink parcel, possibly October. Um, what is the brand again? I forgot what the brand is. Jelly Pong Pong and it's lip butter. But um, I thought it was called something else. Well, the packaging, no, it is Jelly Pong Pong. But the packaging looks very similar to something else to a lipstick I had back then but the colour I had was very very pale and one of my subscribers said that it reminded her very much of like applying concealer to your lips and that is true it was it was the packaging was gorgeous but um the colour was bleh. no no it is it's jelly pong pong and it's a lip butter it doesn't say the colour but look at this gorgeous packaging that is so sweet it's really pretty. So let's see what the colour is like. Hmm. I'm sure it wasn't Jelly Bong Bong we had last time, but never mind. The colour looks similar. <laughs> I'll try it out now. <laughs> Where shall I try it? Ooh, I don't want to do it too high or else I'll break it. I'll try it there. Oh no, this is quite nice. This is quite nice. It's quite sheer. It is. Yeah. It is quite sheer. It's got different tones to it, even though it looks quite matte and quite like like a beige colour. It's more like a pinky rose gold with a slight shimmer. Can you see? That if I go there, down there. That is really nice actually. Shall I try it? Uh -huh. Oh heck. Oh my gosh. Oh no, I've got no lips. <laughs> Where's my lip scrub? It doesn't look like that on my hand. Hmm. No, from looking like that, and it's not the best. Oh, hold on. I've got a mirror here, haven't I? No, that is horrible. No. My daughter. <laughs> yeah, she'd like it. <laughs> So there you go, so that was all the items. I'm really chuffed to them. I'm really, really chuffed. There's a few items that I've never tried before. I'm really looking forward to trying. I think this one is really cool. This carpet looking <laughs> powder. <laughs> and yeah, this nail varnish, that is just so gorgeous. Really, really pretty, really lovely. This as well, this is, I can't wait to use this on my eye, especially that part there. That is gorgeous, the silver. So I think there's, what is there, there's 12 items in all and the clutch. So yeah, not a bad buy, not a bad buy at all. So I hope you like this video and if you've got this bag come in, let me know and let me know if you've already had it and what your thoughts are and uh, yeah, what do you think of this as well? Do you think it's an improvement to my other background? Or should I have gone for something a bit lighter, maybe? I don't know. I'll find out when I edit this video, I suppose. <laughs> so I'll speak to you soon. Take care. Bye.